Almost 10 years ago, I was diagnosed with a rare disease. Everyone was certain I was going to die. That's when I realized that healing and hope won't come from chemicals mixed in any lab. And I needed something much bigger to make me better. Glamour Box is my way of reminding everyone, you have a beautiful soul and a glamorous life. Live it to the fullest and brace yourself because the best is yet to come. Hi Pisces, welcome to my channel. We are doing your eight to the nine. It's your dailies. Let's give it a go. Now, how does a dailies work? Okay, it's fast. Okay, that's plain and simple. Let's keep it going, folks. I'm using a deck and it talks a lot. You just have to slow it, okay? So, okay, so it's the vibe, okay? Catch my drift, let's go. Mm-hmm, here we go, Pisces. Hmm, that was fast. We haven't started though, but we'll choose this for now, but we haven't started. Two of Swords, Three of Cups. Um, decide what makes you happy. Then go for it. Makes you happy this, go there. It's all about a question of happiness. And it's not, it's, you're not being selfish, they say. You have to, oh, you have to choose your happiness, Pisces. Okay, choose your happiness. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Here we go. Choose your happiness. Because your happiness won't choose you, they say. You have to put the effort. Oh, like that. That's deep. That's deep. Happiness won't choose you. No. Here we go. Five of one. Someone is surrendering. Okay. It is a struggle right here. Okay. I call this the toothache card. Hopefully, nobody gets a to toothache. Okay. Okay. Please, please. Okay. <laughs> I have Pisces also in my chart. <laughs> Can't afford that right now. <laughs> I mean, you have no time for that. Okay. Five of Wands. Or you could just go to a dentist, visiting a dentist. Okay. Um, five of Wands is my Saturn card. Where's Saturn in your chart? See, I can get different cards, but this card talks about planets. I swear. 12, 11, 10th house. Career. Okay. Is everybody in the career? <laughs> Why is everybody in the 10th before everybody was in the 4th? So, address uh, Saturn and Sag. Oh, so there's a slow growth. Okay, slow growth for the next year and a half. It's a struggle to get started. You just open a business. It's a struggle. Struggle is real, Sal. Start a career. The struggle is real in this career, Sal. <laughs> Basically, with anything that is going on in your 10th house, it's an enduring process. Work with it. Don't quit. You got to fight for this. Learn to go step by step. Saturn is all about... Um, how to say this? It's almost like go in a Virgo mode because a Virgo mode is a step-by-step -step process. So consistency is the key. Put the time, put the effort. When you do that, Saturn gives you what is owed for you. Everything that you would want. Yeah. Better than Jupiter. Trust me on that one. Jupiter can give you amazing today. Tomorrow is gone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Those are the relationship that happens overnight. Saturn gives you a relationship. Like, oh my God, like it's two years, three years. And then bam. Here comes 30 years. You can't wait to get rid of them, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Four of Pentacles. Not letting go. They're not letting go of you. You're a challenge. The person is being challenged because they can't let go of you or you can't let go of them. Okay? Four of Pentacles is like hold on tight. Hold on tight. You know it's a little bit dangerous, right? So it's a little bit dangerous with this person. Why? Because the struggle is real. Okay? Here we go. Hold on to your savings also. Listen, Pisces, I'll give you this. If your 10th house is already challenged, right? So career is already challenged, then expect to keep saving. Because if my life is being difficult right now, getting that promotion, you know, it's just for a transit, okay? Then you have to keep what is yours right now. So Saturn is teaching you, hold on to your career and hold on to your money. Capiche? Let's go. There we go. So there's two lessons there, okay? Oh, King of Pentacles. Mm -hmm. If it ain't career, I don't know what it is. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. So then, once you learn, you've grown, you mature, here you go. I told you, something that lasts forever. Standing where you're supposed to be, meaning at your prime. Okay? Where is the lover, though? <laughs> oh, there it is. A magician, a business person. Can be a new single person. Magician is always single. They can offer you anything, right? They can give you can give the cups, whatever they want. A magician energy is 
someone, oh, if this is a person, this is Scorpio also, Jishta. Scorpio, not letting go of you, okay? But you're just doing you. It's like, listen, my life right now is going through some changes. It's a little bit difficult. I got no time for you, okay? With this person. If it's a new person, this person is basically still also a clinger, okay? They're like a Klingon, like, hi, you know, it's like Star Trek, okay? <laughs> so they like to hold on to people. They don't like to let go, okay? <laughs> not sure what that means. Here we go. Oh, 12 ones. All right, then I'm just going to be in my couch over here. I'm enjoying my time because I have things to consider right now. Things that is happening that makes me stable is much more important than love. Love doesn't make me stable. Love screws me sometimes. <laughs> That's what this person is saying. Okay? They're teaching you to be... to be independent. This card. Okay? Let me see. Under the Magician of Five Pentacles... <gasps> The Six of Cups. I told you. Saturn's gonna give you someone. Saturn, ruler of karma. Saturn brings your soulmate. How? Look where your Rahu is. This is my Rahu deck, by the way. Um, maybe I should bring that read. But yeah. So Saturn brings you your soulmate. Now, you're gonna tell him, like, oh my god, is this the, lo the one, Sal? Normally, Saturn brings different people. <laughs> can be a Scorpio. Can be a Leo. Can be a Capricorn. But something's coming your way. But they're single. Magician is single. So that's good. Ain't no, got no time for that, okay? I got no time for that. Six of Cups energy. Reconciliation is coming towards you also if you want to reconcile. Now let's split it up and let's go to the extended. I'll see you guys again. Keep shining. Keep smiling. Knowing you can always count for sure. Something like that. All right, Pisces. I'll see you guys again. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye.